Kyiv. A Russian missile strike appeared to target Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky on Wednesday, landing near his motorcade in the Black Sea port city of Odessa, where the president was meeting with Greek Prime Minister Kyriakos Mitsotakis. Zelensky and members of the Greek delegation were not harmed, despite the missile landing some 500 feet away, Greek officials told the Protothema news outlet. The Ukrainian presidential office did not immediately respond to a request for comment. Zelensky and Mitsotakis were visiting the Odessa port around 10.40 am when air raid sirens could be heard. The explosion then occurred within minutes. We witnessed the strike today. Zelensky told reporters after. You see who we're dealing with. They don't care where to hit. I know there were casualties today. I don't know all the details yet, but I know there are casualties. Whether they are military, civilians, international guests, it doesn't matter to these people, he added. Either they've lost their minds, or they have no control over their terrorist army's actions. This emphasizes the need for us to defend ourselves, and the best way is through an air defense system. Throughout two years of war with Russia, Zelensky has frequently traveled throughout Ukraine and has often visited frontline locations at great risk. But Wednesday would mark one of the closest calls for both the president and a visiting foreign leader. We heard the sound of sirens and explosions that were very close to us, Mitsotakis was quoted by the Ukrainian state broadcaster as saying. We didn't have time to go to a safe place. It was a very striking experience, Mitsotakis added. We understand that this war concerns everyone. There are no people who are outside of the war. War spares no one, and Ukraine is resisting barbaric force. It's different to read about the war in the newspaper and to feel it, to hear it with your own ears. Odessa has been particularly hard hit in recent days, and Zelensky has pointed to delays by allies in supplying air defense in contributing to the rising toll of civilian deaths in the city. Over the weekend, a Russian attack on an apartment building killed 12, including five children. Zelensky and Mitsotakis visited the site of the March 2 strike, each laying down a bouquet of flowers at a makeshift memorial in front of the building. Because drones and missiles heading for Odessa are typically launched from the nearby occupied Crimean Peninsula, also on the Black Sea, people there typically have little time to seek shelter after an air alert is declared. The city, which has deep symbolic significance for Imperial Russians, is also an economic lifeline for Ukraine with its busiest port. Ukraine has continued to export grain out of Odessa despite Russia last year exiting a deal that allowed cargo ships safe passage to sail along a corridor in the Black Sea.